If you sit down to lunch with Neil Tyson, three hours can go by and you don't even notice it. He is the heir apparent to Carl Sagan, as far as we're all concerned. Cosmos the Space Time Odyssey builds on the original drama of the first series. So in this new series, our host narrator, Neil deGrasse Tyson, will take us on another journey, this one enhanced by all we've learned since. I'm a scientist working on the frontier in astrophysics. I'm not alone, there are chemists and biologists and engineers. We're all sort of afoot in what is known, searching into what is unknown. I chose Neil because Carl had mentored him when he was a kid in the Bronx. And from that time, for the rest of Carl's life, he stayed in Neil's life. Neil is a true communicator. He's a scientist himself, and he's emerging as his own form of entertainer. And if that person did not exist, he wouldn't be able to do Cosmos. Cosmos, I think, will reignite the fires of curiosity that I know live within us all.